I didn't even think about it that way. That's what I mean. He was the weight on the franchise. <laughs> Pretty much. I couldn't help myself. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Zion's going to show up at my front door. He's going to fly from New but, Orleans. Um, <laughs> yeah, that, that's all I have for the West uh, so far. A couple game ones, uh, a couple game twos played. But, uh, yeah, got some more action tonight and some tomorrow. So, see what happens. Yeah, by the time we get back on, I think by the time we get back on, the first round should be wrapping up and we'll we'll really figure out what the heck is going on with a lot of these teams. Um, you know, we were on with the playing games, but it's going to be interesting to see. Yeah. It looks like most what of happens? should be. And uh, I mean, I think, I think the, I mean, I, the, the writing's on the wall for a lot of the teams anyway, to be honest with you, you can kind of see it. I mean, I love my Sixers, but I mean, I w- would be shocked if they did come back the way that they have been playing and the things that are happening with Joel tweaking the knee and Tyrese being sick and stuff like that. And now I think Kyle Lowry is a little hurt and he's been a beast on defense. I just, I, for them to come back from the two O deficit would be really tough. And honestly, nobody, I didn't really expect anything once Joel went down in January and people forget that he came back early, like three games before. Yeah. Three, like three games before the playoffs early. even started. Yeah. So. Yeah. I think it's really you know, just that one last so night. So people thought that just, maybe it was that over. One's a, that one's just a little bit too much to overcome. It's just tough. Yeah. When you had it in your hands, you know, when you had it in your hands, that that can that can be worse that can be more devastating than just losing the game by yep. 20 is just letting it slip out of your hands 